Hi everyone, welcome to the 2021 Counselors and Partners in Education Breakfast uh, provided by TMCC's Recruitment and Access Center. My name is Miguel Martinez and I'm one of the high school recruiters at the college. I've been here for about five years um, and I go out to some of the local high schools and help high school seniors complete the enrollment process and matriculate to Truckee Meadows Community College. Happy to be here with you all today. Um, we have some great students that are going to talk about their experiences being at TMCC. So I'll go ahead and pass it on to Carlos, who will speak next. Hello, everybody. Thank you for joining us. Carlos Castro Peralta here, and I am the recruiter for adult and non-traditional students. So my main goal is to help students that are 20 years of age and older complete the steps to enroll and select some classes at TMCC. We have a great panel today with us, and I'm so glad you guys are here to join us and uh, to experience uh, our students' experiences at TMCC. So we're gonna go ahead and get started right away. So my first question is for all of you, um, tell us about yourself, maybe your high school attended, the degree you're pursuing, and any degrees, any hobbies that you have. We'll go ahead and get started with Imelda. Hello everyone, my name is Imelda Gonzalez Ojeda. Um, I graduated from Hug High School in 2018 and I am double majoring in human development and family sciences as well as elementary education um, in hopes of becoming a teacher later on. And one of my hobbies is reading. Um, and I just recently graduated from TMCC and transferred over to UNR. You could go next, Jenny. Awesome. Hi guys. So my name is Jen from Mayorga Correa. I am, I attended North Valley's high school. I'm class of 2020. Uh, right now I am studying social work in hopes to one day become a high school or college counselor. Uh, some of the hobbies that I like to do is I like working out and I also graduate this spring. So that's exciting. And I'm hoping to attend UNR uh, next fall. Uh, Miguel, would you, I'd like to pass it on to Miguel. All right. Uh, hi, everyone. My name is Miguel Lizaola. Uh, I graduated from Galena High School back in 2020 as well. So uh, my degree is political science. I wanted to become a lawyer. Uh, what kind of lawyer? I'm still not sure, but uh, I'll probably figure it out more as I continue with my uh, career. But um, yeah, so my hobbies, uh, they include hiking, working out, you know, hanging out with friends, things like that. So uh, back to you, Miguel. Yeah, um, I'm going to uh, ask this question of all of you all. So I, I appreciate you telling us a little bit about yourself. And we're just going to go a little bit more into it, uh, specifically about your experiences at TMCC and selecting to come to TMCC. So I'll start off with Jenny. But if you all can respond to the question about how was your experience selecting a college and why did you end up choosing TMCC? Yeah, definitely. So the reason why I ended up uh, choosing TMCC was because how affordable it was, because I know if I ended up going to a four-year institution, it was going to be more money. And that was something I didn't want to put my parents through. And a lot of the scholarships that I received, like it was going to pay my whole entire tuition at TMCC. So I made that choice to come to TMCC for myself. And another thing is because I felt like I didn't really have it all figured out. And so that's why I also chose TMCC. I'd like to pass it on to Amelda. Thank you, Jenny. Um, the reason I chose to come to TMCC was just because I already had experience coming here um, throughout high school. I was a Jumpstart student. And so I had already been here to the campus, knew some of the instructors, and I really liked it. Um, through my senior year, I applied to Nevada Promise and uh, uh, to Summer Bridge. And so that really solidified me choosing TMCC as uh, my school for college. Uh, Miguel, would you like to go next? Yeah, so for me, uh, I just had taken some classes with TMCC beforehand. I took a, a chemistry class here uh, before back in like uh, 2017. And I also took an EPY class before. So for me, I decided to go with TMCC because of those classes. 
like I really enjoyed those classes and I decided, you know, it'd be better just to go here, uh, especially because of the affordability, uh, all the classes and everything and all the, the transfer options that we have. So uh, that was just my main factor in deciding. Uh, next question. All right, guys, thank you. Thank you for sharing your, your thought process of choosing TMTC and uh, we're glad to have you here. All right, so for the next question, this one is for Jenny and Miguel. We know um, you guys experienced COVID during your senior year at your high school. Um, you got to miss out on a, a lot of cool things like graduation and all those parts. So my question is, how was your first year at TMTC? I know um, the classes were virtual, but how was your experience taking virtual classes at TMTC during this um, unfortunate pandemic time? I'll go ahead and start with Jenny. So my first year experiencing virtual classes, it, um, I'm very used to taking in-person classes. So it was a big adjustment to going from taking in-person to online. But I mean, the professors, they were really great. Two of the professors that I had was my English professor, Emily Kings, and um, my psych professor, Chris Jones. They were super, super great. Like if I had a question, they were there. They were, they gave us their number. They were like super on top of like emailing us, reminding us, oh, look, this assignment is due. Make sure you get it done. If you need any help, please don't hesitate. Please let us know. Like we're here to help you during those difficult moments that since it was like, when COVID was super bad. So, I mean, they were there and they really tried to connect with us, even though it was virtual and even though we couldn't see them, they they were really like great trying to like, like I said, connect with us, build that relationship with your professor and a student, you know what I mean? So it was great, great professors. If whenever like I get the, the, op, the choice to recommend professors to, to students, I really say, hey, you know, you should go to them, they're, they're great. So, Miguel, I'd like to pass it on to you. Okay, uh, so similar to Jenny, it was, you know, the professors made it um, just better because um, although this wasn't my first time with online classes, I took uh, geometry online in my uh, high school time. So uh, for me, the, the big help was that uh, professors would motivate students, right? They would... Um, just try to give some words of encouragement, try to make the student laugh, you know, just have like a, a good time with the class while they're trying to uh, just do all the assignments and everything. And uh, for me, one uh, professor, his name is Joshua Shin. He, um, he actually really helped me with my writing and he's definitely a professor I would recommend if you're looking for a challenge, right? And to improve your writing. Uh, I'll be definitely taking him again this semester. So uh, that's basically how my experience went with uh, virtual classes. Awesome. Thank you both for sharing how that experience was for you. Um, and the next question is going to be for Imelda because she was with us uh, pre-COVID and during COVID. So if you can talk a little bit about how your experience was taking in-person classes compared to online classes, and then if you can also discuss how the transfer um, experience was for you to go from TMCC to a four-year university as well. Yeah, so um, pre-COVID, most of my classes were um, in person. I did take some online classes, um, and my online classes, I honestly love them so much. Uh, the interaction with the instructor and with the students, everything was um, was so good. Everything was a very hands-on, which is a way that like I really enjoy learning. I'm able to um, really get to know like the material when that happens. Um, during COVID, we did have to transition into online. So it, it was a little difficult, but just like how um, Miguel and Jenny have said, the instructors really um, came through, honestly, because they, uh, they helped me through um, making sure that my assignments were like the best that they like could be. They, they honestly like worked so hard to keep like the class engaged. Um, 
And then transitioning over to UNR, um, it honestly went pretty smoothly because throughout my um, years here at TMCC, I worked alongside my academic advisor who always uh, made sure that I was taking the classes that were for my degree and that were transferable. And then I also worked along my UNR academic advisor. So working alongside both of them, I was able to transition smoothly from TMCC over to UNR. Thank you for sharing your experience, Imelda. And, um, and you bring up a great point. We have great, excellent academic advisors that they will make sure you're taking the correct classes for you to achieve your long-term goal. And your first semester, you let them know whether it's your one-year certificate, two-year degree, or a four-year degree, if that's your goal, they'll make sure you're taking the right classes and all of your classes were transferred to a four-year university. So. So shout out to our academic advisors out there. All right, yep. All right, next question. And this question is for Jenny and Miguel. And um, I want you guys to talk a little bit about your student work experience here at TMCC. Um, I know we have a, a bunch of great student workers with the Recruitment and Access Center, and we appreciate all of you. You guys do great work. And yeah, you guys make us look so good by everything that you do. So thank you. So go ahead and speak a little about your student work experience at TMCC. I'll go ahead and hand it off to Miguel first. All right, so a bit of my experience here was that uh, they are really flexible with your work. Um, for me, right, uh, I used to work at my high school and I would be able to work uh, anytime that I wanted right before classes or during lunch and uh, that's basically what's going on here um, if you have any like in-person classes they will work around your schedule but if you have virtual ones they give you time to like or if you have time basically to uh, do any assignments or anything like that they're they're completely all right with it so uh, I remember I actually did that too right I uh, finished up an essay during my work hours and it was completely fine uh, the schedule itself was just, you know, um, it's nice. Like you just tell them what you prefer and they help you out to choose the hours that you'd want. Uh, right. So that's a huge plus for me since I have a busy life sometimes, you know, uh, parents, siblings, things like that. So, uh, yeah, not only that, the networking was was also nice. I got to meet a lot of people, you know, experience a lot of things I couldn't or probably wouldn't if I didn't sign up for this um, job. Uh, so yeah, uh, Jenny, do you want to speak about yours? Yeah, definitely. So student employment, I really like it. I like how they're super duper flexible with your hours. Like they're super like understanding about like if you have a class like let's say at like 12, they won't schedule you that day. Like they won't schedule you around 12. Like they, like I said, they're very, very understanding, very considerate about what time you have class and they really prioritize your education, which I really like. So um, networking, uh, the way I kind of found out about this job was through my success coach since I was in a, um, a six week program here at TMCC called Summer Bridge. And so uh, my success coach, Yuli Chavez actually um, gave me the opportunity to work for uh, the recruitment access center and so I kind of networked since the job that I had previously wasn't really working out for me like, because I felt like I wasn't growing as an individual and I really wanted to grow more into a professional aspect and me grow more into like the person I wanted to be for my future career and so I contacted her and I was like hey you know like I'm looking for a job do you think like you can help me out and so she got me this job here at the recruitment access center and like I felt like now being here I've grown so much and I've grown to exactly what career I want to go into why I want to go into it and like me being me working here has taught me that you know what maybe this is exactly what I want to go into I want to become a, a high school counselor a college counselor and take this route so kind of like developing like I said exactly what I want to do in future future wise so yeah thank you that's great that the student employment opportunities at tmcc have given you all 
so much and it's allowed you to like define your career and figure out what you want to do you know those are life-changing experiences that you've had here at TMCC so that's that's really great to hear um, and I know you all like a lot of things about TMCC not from what you've just said in the panel but in our own private conversations that we've had but I'm asking you in this next question to narrow it down to just one so if you all can just tell me what's one of your favorite things about TMCC and we'll go ahead and get started with Imelda first yeah so like you said there's definitely a lot of things that i honestly really love about tmcc um i guess one of my favorite things would be um, being able to get this job i was also like you know um i was speaking to my success um success first coach and gear up ambassador miss maddie and i had told her how i was just interested in getting a job and she helped me get this job and um yeah, one of my favorite things is being able to network. I've been able to get to know a lot of people that I wouldn't have known otherwise. Um, and then I was able to get opportunities such as like the Board of Regents Scholar. And then um, this along with my uh, refund checks from financial aid were able to help me um, just focus on my studies and not have to like worry about my finances. So yeah, I think like getting this job was like really one of my favorite things. Miguel. All right, so uh, it's really, really hard to choose, right? But um, for me, I'd say it's probably the feeling of like, of a house, like of a home. Uh, for me, it feels just like a family, right? All these nice scenic places, all the places you can go to, to study, to hang out with friends, you know, just talk. Um, really feels uh, like you're at home. And then with the staff members and everything, like all these people that I've talked to just, you know, it makes it feel like a family. So it's like a second home to me. Um, I like how you can just go in any campus and just talk with anyone and you would just, you'd know them, you know, you can talk with anything, you know, or anyone. So yeah, that's probably my favorite part. Uh, Jenny, if you want to go next. Yeah, awesome. Um, yeah, definitely. So one of the things that I really, one of my favorite things about TMCC is how diverse this community college is. I, I like how I was able to take an in-person class my last semester and everybody was so different and all the connections that I built with everybody, like you really connect with everybody one-on-one, -on -one. like here at the Recruitment Access Center, the amount of connections I've built you know, so it's super great. You know, you you meet new people, you network. So everybody, like, like I said, you find things in common with everybody. And it's super great because you all like find a true friendship, like a family. So I really like that. It's not only like a family, but it's a community and how we all bond together. So yeah. Thank you guys for for sharing your favorite things. And I definitely agree with you. Um, I love working here at a community college. We're small. Um, we know everyone from every department. So we're always able to, to assist the students, whether they need something from financial aid, admissions and records, the DRC, we're able to, to connect them to the right person uh, because we have those close relationships with all the staff here at TMCC. So thank you for sharing. All right, and this is our last question, and this is for everybody. Um, you guys were all high school seniors a couple of years ago. So, so what would you recommend to a high school senior? I know um, it's a fun time. You're ending your high school career, but at the same time, it's a very stressful um, situation where you got to make choices about colleges, careers, universities, scholarships, applications, ACTs, all that fun stuff. So what would you rec recommend to a high school senior? How would they go about choosing a college or university? And I'll go ahead and get started with Imelda first. Yeah, so something that I would recommend to high school seniors is um, just to start thinking about college, like like soon because um if you put off college and like all the steps towards college your senior year will be a lot more stressful um so just apply to college um even if you don't know what you want to be just 
um, go ahead and get the steps steps done so that you do not feel that stressed out and your your senior year could be more relaxed. Jenny? Yeah, definitely. I totally agree with you. Um, One thing that I would recommend to high school seniors is it's okay not to have it figured out. Like it's totally okay. Cause I knew that I was in that position. Like I felt like I had to have everything figured out. Like I felt like I need to do this career. If not, I don't want to start over you, but it's okay to make that mistake and say, Hey, you know, maybe that's not going to do it with me or Hey, you know, like, like that's not meant for me. And that's totally fine. And I feel like a lot of people think like, you need to have this figured out. Like it's not like that. So I feel like the reason why I chose TMCC is because I didn't have it figured out. And I feel like me coming to TMCC was like, hey, you know, it's two, I have two years or so on years to figure it out. And here at TMCC, like we have like great programs or even if school's not meant for you, we have certificates. We have um, two year uh, class, uh, two, you can get your two year associates or one year being in school for one semester it's totally okay you know like school's not meant for everyone and that's totally fine you know or school is meant for you and you want to go to a four-year institution that's fine too you know that's why I, I what I would recommend to a high school senior you don't have to have it figured out I'd like to pass it on to Miguel all right so uh for me my recommendation would be just to reach out to people I mean you have all these like wonderful counselors, right? You can talk to them if they if you need anything. Um, my counselor, she would always help with uh, any sort of test or anything like that. If you asked about a college, she would like know. She would give you all these like wonderful information, right? Uh, even if you do decide to go to Team CC, we still have like counselors who can help you transfer to other uh, institutions, right? You can see which classes you can take, or if you don't know what you're doing, you know. Uh, you can also try to figure it out here. Uh, we have five wonderful options. We've got lots of classes, degrees and everything. So um, if you wanna just come here just to see what you wanna do, then yeah, that, that's great. But yeah, that's, that's my recommendation. All right, thank you for sharing all of your experiences and all of your tips, guys. Thank you so much. And uh, we've come to the end of the student panel. Thank you, Miguel, for joining us. And the student workers, we appreciate you guys so much. And uh, thank you for sharing your experiences. And, um, and you said a great thing, Miguel, at the end that just to, to ask, right? Ask questions, reach out. Um, we know college is, it's new. It's a little difficult, right, to enroll all the steps. Uh, but we're here to help you out and we're here to answer your questions and we're going to be here through your whole college career uh, to make sure you're successful. So thank you everybody for joining us for this student panel and if you have any questions about anything that we said, if you have questions for the students, you can reach us at recruitment at tmcc.edu. Have a great day. Thank you.